Welcome to the how to embed ASP.NET Pages tutorial. We have here an empty uh, Visual Web Weave project and we'll start by adding a new ASP.NET page. Now let's add some controls to the uh, ASP.NET page. We'll add two text boxes and a button. Let's save the form. Now let's have the uh, click event of the button copying the text from one text box to another. So we'll do this dot text box two dot text equals this dot text box one dot text. Now we have a uh, working ASP.NET page. And let's go ahead back to the Visual Web GUI form and let's add the uh, ASP page box control. And let's enlarge the control. Now let's define the uh, pass property of the ASP page box control. It will be web form one dot ASPX, and we should have a uh, working Visual Web application with the uh, ASP dot net page embedded. Okay, let's test the uh, ASP dot net page. Let's add, let's set the text and the text is copied. Now let's go ahead and send in parameters and we will do that by inheriting from the uh, gizmox.webgui.forms.hosts.asp page base instead of the asp.net page base and now we can do this dot page context which is actually the uh, ASP page box dot text and we'll take this value and insert to the uh, text box one dot text and we will do it only if we are not in uh, we are not in post back, so it will ha will happen only uh, the first time. Let's compile the application now. Let's go back to the uh, Visual Web GUI form. Let's set the uh, text property of the uh, ASP page box, and let's set it to this is a test. Okay. Now let's run the application. Now we can see the uh, ASP.NET page has received the uh, text parameter of the uh, ASP page box and you can uh, implement inherent your own uh, ASP uh, page box and add your own uh, parameters and by casting the uh, page context to your uh, type you can access your control. That's all for this tutorial. Thank you for watching.